So here's the uh, an old Skyjack. It was a 3220 scissor lift. Uh, this was hydraulic lift, drive, and steer. Uh, the machine was junk. So I uh, cut off the drive and steer and just put some casters. Um, took off two of the scissor stacks. Uh, so there's just one stack because obviously it went up, you know, 20 feet. Now it only goes up maybe 10 feet. Um, put a different lift cylinder in in a different location. Uh, 12 volt pump and motor off another junk machine. Uh, and this will be the new workbench. Uh, it'd be neat if it went a little lower. Obviously, my other old lift was that Harbor Freight motorcycle lift. Got that one maybe 10 years ago. Uh, and it worked fine, uh, but it only went up, you know, two and a half feet, three feet. Um, where this one now, I can go all the way up and put more junk up in the rafters um, instead of trying to carry it up the ladder. The only thing left, I guess, is to mount the battery. And uh, there's a top for it over there. I have to bend that up um, to make the new top. On this other Harbor Freight one, I had built this top for it, which is now my another workbench. Um, but I built it kind of fast, and I didn't care, and it didn't come out too straight. Uh, I kind of bowed on the edges from welding it and it shrinking. So when you squared something up, it was kind of, you know, you always had to shim it or fuck around it. I was always disappointed at myself for rushing that deal. <clears throat> so this other top, I'll make sure not to rush, compensate for the shrinkage when welding it all together so I have a nice bench um, yeah so here we go so got to mount the battery I don't know if I said that oh that's down of course the battery that I'm using on the jump pack is not very good so you heard the motor bog down that's the batteries in there a week. A couple of relays and some thin wire to a switch. I'll stop it right here. So here's a new cylinder mount. It's obviously gravity down. That's just vented atmosphere. A new bracket. Uh, you know there was these inch and three quarter by maybe 20 by 3 foot two of them pieces of steel in here you can see the other half is still sitting here uh, for weight and uh, it didn't really do much structurally because it was only tack welded in there uh, so I cut those out and that probably lightened the base up maybe about 500 pounds so it rolls a little easier now with those gone Yeah. Here it is. Also have the <clears throat> a manual descent, or obviously you can hit the switch, go down. So just mount the battery in the top. So this deck also is about seven feet long, and the new uh, top is about eight feet long, so it'll overhang. Uh, when it's in the down position, it'll overhang the pump there. I really don't think I need a cover for it. Anyway, that is my new workbench. See ya.